The report of the fire in the Tokyo Star Hotel came at 2 a.m. Residents of the hotel say they did not hear any alarm. They were woken up by knocking on the doors and screams of the staff. There was no alarm. We woke up because someone was knocking on the door. There was a lot of devices, but none worker in any of the room. I heard that someone was yelling the world wiring, and then I opened the door. Someone knocked at 1.30 a.m. and we wanted to collect our belongings. There was smoke in the hallway, and we left all of it. Several rooms were on fire. People broke windows and jumped out. Some made it, some didn't. Firemen arriving to the hotel established that the second floor of the building was on fire. 200 square meters housed more than 200 people. 136 people were evacuated. 29 of them were foreigners. The fire was extinguished in almost two hours. The main efforts were allocated to search and rescue of people, as well as finding where the fire started. This operation was complicated by the size of floor space and amounts of smoke. Nine people died in the fire, among them five men and three women. One body is currently being identified. Seven people were delivered to the hospital with burns. Six of them are in critical condition. Seven victims were taken to the hospital. According to the severity of the condition, six victims were hospitalized in the anesthesiology and resuscitation ward of the burn department. One patient with moderate symptoms was hospitalized in the burn department. The hotel was outfitted with smoke and fire detectors as well as fire extinguishing equipment. Guards of the hotel could have identified and reported the fire earlier, but called fire department too late. This was stated by the police. There are three versions so far. First one is possible murder, after which arson was committed to cover up the crime. Second version, breach of fire safety rules. Third version is mishandling of fire by residents of the hotel. Where did the version about a crime came from? Why wasn't it dealt with at night? There are many questions. We will get all answers after each specialist performs work in his respective field. So far, it is too early to say what happened. Odessa resident Alexandru gave shelter to 20 hotel residents in his own apartment. They were placed in other hotels in the morning. I was just walking home. My friend had a birthday not far from here. I saw people. They were in trouble. I gathered people. I took in mostly women with children and elderly women. I gave them what I could. First of all, I fed them and gave them warm tea. Tokyo Star Hotel used to be a tram depot. It had 270 rooms. Some of them had no windows. According to Odessa Media, it is one of the cheapest in the city. One room costs less than $14 a night. It is located near the train station and the market. After the fire, Ukrainian government initiated large-scale inspections of hotels and spas for fire protection. President of Ukraine Volodymyr Zelensky said that the owner of the hotel will face consequences. Reported by Anna Hordensova for UATV.